Hey guys. So I'm not sure what kind of vlog you expect from me. It was like 2 in the afternoon and I finally got up. Got up. I went and made some toast. Um, I don't feel good today. I wasn't feeling good last night, but today, oh, no, it's worse. I don't want to force myself to edit the vlog that should be up today so I don't, like, miss a day. I don't know what kind of vlog you guys are going to get, like, it's in terms of what's being recorded today. Look who's out by. She won't turn around and face the camera. But she's leaving anyway. Well, since this is only my third clip of the day, maybe fourth, I don't know. I'm going to make today's vlog a little longer. I know I have hat hair, but it's like 20 degrees outside. And it's cold, and it's just outside. Jess was nice enough. Um, I was still kind of hungry. I had some, some a sandwich from a restaurant for dinner, but I was still kind of hungry. She was nice enough to take me out to grab something else. Because she knows I didn't eat all day. Uh, because I wasn't feeling good, and I felt really weak earlier. Like I might have explained to you guys. I'm not sure. But if I didn't, uh, I did now. <laughs> so now I'm going to... I have the new video up, the new vlog. It's been out for a while, but um, I haven't publicized it. So I'm going to publicize it, and then I'm going to let you know about these new things that I got from Taco Bell. Okay, my late night snack. My late night snack is one of the, is the new grilled stuff nacho from Taco Bell. I got two of them because I didn't know how big they were. For a dollar thirty, like they're pretty big. Um, supposed to be everything you like about nachos. Um, yeah. I don't know how this is gonna work out, but this has got sour cream in it and cheese and meat and I don't know. I'm not gonna eat it on camera, but I'll eat it and then tell you what I think. So it's getting late, it's actually 2 a.m. and this is going to be my last clip for the day. It'll be this one and then I'll say goodnight. But I don't know if it's going to be the same clip or whatever, it doesn't really matter because it'll be the same video to you guys. But I wanted to talk to you guys about how I've been feeling lately outside of physically. And I've been thinking in my head for a little while tonight, could this possibly be leading to me physically feeling the way I have been today and yesterday and lately? Because um, I haven't been really telling you guys what's up. Um, lately I've just been feeling really down, just like something's missing, like, and it, it's nothing to do with my relationship or anything like that, so don't, don't think that it's something to do with, like, that, it's something to do with a lot of things. I think there's just a lot of stuff that I used to do and I used to love to do, um, that are gone at the minute, like, they're not gone, gone, they're just, like, missing, and... I think that part of the reason that I'm not feeling great is because I'm trying to force myself to replace them with other things, such as the gaming channel. Like, I'm specifically talking about, like, art. I used to go out and take photos all the time, and I used to go out, and I used to paint, and I used to draw, and I used to just do a lot of fun stuff, and... I don't know. I used to go out and take photos with my camera, and uh, I have the goal of getting three photo books done this year, and... As much as I want to do that, I just I feel like there's no reason to do anything. Right now, my car is messed up, so if it's raining or snowing in the nighttime, I can't go anywhere, which really sucks, because it's just a headlight that's messed up. But since the headlight's messed up, I can't drive at night or anything, so I can't even go out like get sun sunset pictures or stuff like that. And I feel like asking Jess to take me anywhere like that is, one, probably pretty boring for her, and two, like this huge, like, I feel like it's a huge burden. Because it's not her, not that she wouldn't enjoy being in it, but I feel like it's not her world necessarily. Like, I don't know how to explain it. Not that she wouldn't appreciate what I'm doing. But not even that she would tell me no. It's just, when you come down to it, like, I feel like having to rely on anybody to do what I want to do and what I feel like I should do is just not, not good. Part of it is because, like, I don't have a job, and it sucks, and <laughs> there are days that I vlog three clips and lay in bed the rest of the day. Because I feel like I have no reason to get out of bed. 
And I've got all this art stuff for Christmas, and I feel like it's going to waste. I feel like I haven't, I have no reason to touch it. <clears throat> Which isn't true. I have a couple of little ideas, like you saw on the the vlog the other day, where I sketched out the little bunny with the skull face, or skull with the bunny. I, I don't know how you would call it. It just feels like I've been throwing myself at YouTube so hard, and using it strictly as a way to, like, fill a void that's just not going to be able to be filled like that. I kind of want to say, like, I want to say, I'm not saying this, but I want to say, like, I want to stop doing everything except for vlogging for a long time, just for now, and just kind of get my head back on straight. But I don't want to really say that because I enjoy doing the gaming videos, but I can't... I don't know. I can't treat the gaming videos like a job. It gets boring to me too quickly. I enjoy doing the vlogs. I've been doing them for over 280 days now. It's like breathing to me now. Like, I wake up and I grab the camera. <laughs> and then I'd be the first thing I do. I mean, not like vlog first thing when I get up. But if there's anything worth saying, anything worth showing you, anything worth looking at, I grab the camera. If we're leaving the house, the camera goes. Like, you may not get footage while I'm out. But I'm still, even though I've gone 200 something days, I'm still catching my, I'm still, what, how do I want to say, I'm still getting my vlogging legs. I'm still not used to vlogging in public yet, so I haven't, I haven't gotten the guts to do that. I just, I don't know, like, I had this great idea to do the gaming channel and everything, and it's a good channel, and I like it so far, and it's got a good response, and part of me just feels like, I'm so unfulfilled in that aspect of my life. It's nothing that anybody can help me with, like, but I just feel like, blah. And that's part of the reason we quit doing the Insane Smokes channel, is because we just, we didn't know what to do with it next, because I didn't want to do it anymore. You know, like, I, I felt like it was, like, choking me. Even though it wasn't, like, literally nothing was choking me. The smoke wasn't choking me or anything like that. I just didn't care. Well, now, honestly, uh, I don't know if I could, honestly, make any more sense than that. <laughs> I know that sounds dumb, but I... So maybe I need to let everything but my vlogs hit the back burner and just keep vlogging and because those are the vlogs that, those are the videos I enjoyed putting up, you know. It doesn't take me two hours to record a piece of content and it doesn't take me two hours to edit it. Well, sometimes it does, but, you know. At one point I even thought about stopping vlogging, even though I love doing it. I, I just thought about it. Like, I shouldn't do it anymore. But then I realized, you know, I don't think I want to stop. Vlogging isn't the problem. Vlogging is not something I threw myself into to try and stuff up a void. Vlogging is something I did because I thought that, you know, it might be interesting to look back on this kind of stuff. But I don't want to look back and just see myself sitting around and feeling just. I don't know guys I can't explain what I'm thinking maybe I need to sit down and have a talk with Ben because like he's not into the gaming channel as much as he you know he not as it should be but he we haven't recorded a single thing together maybe that's it maybe I feel like I'm doing all the work I don't know I have done all the videos by myself but I didn't think there was a problem. Maybe I just feel cluttered. Because both of my rooms that I spend all my time in, my, my bedroom and my studio, are cluttered as I'll get out. They're not clean. I need to clean them. Maybe I'll do that. Maybe I'll start cleaning them. Every time I say I'm going to clean them, it's like one of those things like, yeah, I'm going to clean it. And then you go and you sit there and like, like I did this morning, I said I was going to clean, but I said I didn't feel good I was going to clean anyway. 
I just kind of looked around and was like, where the hell do I start? Like, where do I start cleaning this junk up? I don't know, guys. I'm going to stop being so depressing, <laughs> and I'm going to let you guys go to sleep. But, thank you so much for watching. I love every one of you guys who freaking watch my videos, especially the ones who watch them all the time. You guys are awesome. Subscribe if you haven't already. If you're new especially, remember it's free, so it doesn't cost you anything, and I'm not always this down. Remember to hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, share the videos with your friends so they can come hang out. Hopefully, you know, the vlogs get better. Hopefully, I, I get in back into my more positive mood. Tomorrow, a big snowstorm's coming in, so we'll see how that goes. Alright, guys. Good night. If anybody wants to find me, I'll be in the last place you would look. In a place where people used to be.